Welcome back. I'm going to show you in this video how you can use Tiny Database to score your high score. So even after you close your app, when you come back, your score is still there. Additionally, I'll show you how you can reset that score in case one of your friends beats you. So on this main page, you can see I've added in the Tiny Database non-visible component that's accessible via the storage section on the left side. And we've also added a reset button to the main screen, which is called reset. Going into the blocks, I'll show you the code that I used to do these features. The first thing that we need to do is set, so when screen one initializes, so when you load the app, it checks to see if there's a score stored in the tiny database tag high score. If there isn't, it sets the global high score to zero. And if there is, it sets it to whatever score was stored there last time. It also then reprints the high score, so it doesn't just show zero, which was the originally initialized value. When the score is going up as you're scoring points during the game, the call tiny database store value is used. And so as the global score is being checked to see if that's a new high score, that value is then being updated in the tiny database. What this means is that you could possibly be scoring points and reach a high score of say 10. And then if the obstacle steals one of your points, it would go down to nine, but the global high score, but the stored high score value would stay at 10. So you might lose the game with zero points, but you will still have your high score saved, at whatever the highest point value you attained was. And to make the reset button work, we use the tiny database store value again and set the value to store to zero, set the global high score to zero, and then set the high score to display as zero. Additionally, I set it so that the roller and the obstacle both stop moving. So it essentially ends whichever game you are on at that point. So there you have it. This is a basic implementation of the tiny database function that is built into the MIT App Inventor. Thanks for watching.